We will be rain free probably until about Wednesday night or Thursday. In the meantime, it's 63 degrees, plenty of sunshine out there. Not much of a wind chill right now, but the winds have been rather cool coming in from the northeast direction and humidity at 48%. Compare that to the rest of the metro area, and you look at it when you go 63 at KCI. Uh, Gardner's at 63 with Olathe and Lee Summit at 65. And the wind speeds anywhere from about 10 to 15 miles an hour. Again, because of the wind coming in from the northeast direction, that's a cool breeze. And the winds really won't uh, subside any overnight tonight. They'll remain around 10 miles an hour and they'll continue even through uh, for your Sunday. But the main focus for us will be just a lot of cloudiness. We've seen the clouds come in earlier today across eastern Kansas, now crossing the state line into western Missouri. And it looks like it's going to be that way even for the entire night. If you do have evening plans, you're going to head out and about, let's say after sunset, it'll drop back down to 57 degrees. And despite the cloudiness, it should be rain free. But look at the chances of rain all around us. A little bit of rainfall in the Dakotas, down through Nebraska, Oklahoma, Texas getting in some rain. Of course, you saw the moisture streaming from the hurricane now hitting Atlantic coastal states. In fact, it's pushing all the way into the Appalachians of Kentucky and Tennessee. We're kind of like in the middle. We're not getting the rainfall, but in due time, our rain chances will increase as we get into next week. Future scan basically just says, hey, it's going to be cloudy the next 24 to 36 hours for us, but no rainfall expected. So you'll have that sunshine peeking through at times and the temperature struggling, but it will be on the rise for the next several days. So let's talk about that forecast. Kind of give you a timeline here. Tomorrow morning, you'll start out around 44 degrees. It'll climb up to about 58 degrees at 12 noon. Then you get into the 60s by 4 o'clock. That's your daytime high, 63, and then dropping down to 59 and then 57 by tomorrow evening as, as we'll continue with the temperatures trying to get back to normal. And uh, looks like that's going to happen as early as Tuesday next week. The rest of you, uh, about the mid 60s, no matter where you look, south of I 70 and even north of I 70, a very pleasant day. All right. As we talk about the tomorrow into the seven day forecast, you're going to see how nice changes on the way. Very comfortable 68 and 72 for Monday and Tuesday. We actually get closer to normal and then surpass normal by mid next week. It's got the next chance of any rain with a cold front coming through on Thursday night. And look what it does drops yeah. your temperatures by next weekend. Yeah.